Timmerman decided to help remove the explosives, arguably the most dangerous part of the bridge crossing. There, he found himself with four other random soldiers who had scurried across and into the center of the bridge like he had. These men were Lieutenant Hugh Mott, Sergeant Eugene Dorland, and Sergeant John Reynolds. Together, they hurriedly began removing the dozens of explosives lining the underside of the Ludendorff Bridge, cutting the wires and physically removing the explosives by hand. John W. Mitchell, an eyewitness to the event, described Timmerman cutting the wires. While we were running across the bridge, and man, it may have been only 250 yards, but it seemed like 250 miles to us, I had spotted this lieutenant standing out there completely exposed to the machine gun fire that was pretty heavy by this time. He was cutting wires and kicking the German demolition charges off the bridge with his feet. Boy, that took plenty of guts. He was the one who saved the bridge and made the whole thing possible. 